Hey everybody, it's Todd Bartusik with Berkshire Hathaway Real Estate and the All Metro Real Estate Group. So I'm coming to you today with the September market report. That's for Douglas and Sarpy County, existing houses only. We backed the new construction out. Okay, so uh, we saw a decrease in homes sold um, from August to September of about 12%. So from 765 down to 673. Doesn't surprise me. I mean, this time of the year, it just kind of starts to slow down a little bit. Um, now our average sale price actually went up about 1%. So from 357 almost to about you know, like 360 and some change. Um, a lot of that had to do with the fact that the interest rate, like the interest rates have dropped about a point over the last 30 days or so. So um, while there are some houses that might need some, you know, freshening up, um, you know, whether it's cosmetics or some condition of the house, um, the the overall, the first time home buyer price point is still moving pretty good. So, um, so that's, you know, that's a positive thing to see. So that's the overall market. Then I want to talk about um, the first time home buyer price point, and that is uh, zero to three hundred fifty thousand. So we dropped about the same as as the overall Omaha. There, we dropped eleven and a half percent from four seventy eight to four hundred twenty three on the number of units sold, and we went from two forty seven six to about 249.3, so up 0.7%. So again, still moving in the right direction, um, you know, and so that's also positive um, to see for the market. Days on market staying about the same. We went on an average of nine in August to an average of 13 in September. So the next uh, segment I like to talk about is the move up. That's 350 to 750. We dropped almost 19% there. We went from 274 units down to 223. Um, we still rose in price point though, um, or, or average sale price. We went from 457 to about 461 and some small change, so up about 1%. Um, days on market, 13 in August to 17 in September. So, so still pretty uh, uh, similar there. Um, then our luxury market, we saw an increase in homes sold of 5.6%, so from 36 to 38. Now we dropped in price point because some of those houses overall were just a little lower priced. Um, we went from 1,144,000 in August, uh, that was the average sale price, to a million and 10,000 in September. Um, days on market sat a little bit more. We went from 24 to 33. So overall, guys, again, the market is still strong. It's still solid. But what I would say is it's honestly, it's, it's kind of balancing out a bit, um, normalizing, you know, if you will. Um, it's not the crazy market that we saw, you know, a couple years ago where we would see 10, 15, 20 offers, you know, on a first time home buyer price point. But we're still seeing those. I just had one recently in Bellevue that was a starter house. We had three offers, um, went over list price, very clean contracts. Um, at the end of the day, our inventory is rising. Um, and right now we do have fewer buyers. So the reason that's really, really important to, to pay attention to is if you are a seller, your house has got to be dialed in. It's got to shine, um, you know, from this, from the moment somebody pulls it up online, right? Because that's your first showing is what I would say. Your first showing is online, um, to the time that they pull up to the driveway or, or pull in front of the house, that curb appeal, right? I mean, we got to have a manicured lawn. Our, our, our trees, our bushes, everything needs to look good, new mulch, just all that stuff. Um, right, you know, right down to the inside, you know, where we have stainless appliances, um, where the house is, has been, you know, detailed. Like if you sell a car, you detail that car. It's really kind of the same concept, obviously on a bigger and more, you know, in-depth scale, um, but it's still very, very important to make the house shine. So um, if you find this information and the data useful, I've been doing this now for going on about two years, um, please uh, you know, subscribe to my social media and my YouTube channel also. Um, and if you ever have any questions, please put my, my almost 25 years you know, to benefit and to work for you and call me anytime with any questions. Thanks again for watching. Have a great one.